Greetings and salutations. My name is Aura Cult and welcome to my sanctuary. For those of you who are new here, you're very, very welcome. I hope you like what you see and stick around. Subscribe, like the video, comment down below. I'd love to talk to you guys, so it would be really, really cool if you did say something, ask me a question, anything. And for those of you who are returning visitors, thank you very much. Hopefully you're subscribed as well. That really, really helps me, so thanks for those who did. Anyway, the topic of this video. I've seen quite a few videos that are not sort of subculture related around Instagram made me buy this kind of thing. So I thought it'll be fun to do something like that in the sense of goth sort of style and stuff that's around Instagram. I spend a lot of time on Instagram because I like looking at pictures that are aesthetically pleasing and find out new brands and follow them and you know see if I can find anything I like. So I would really really like to share some of the stuff that I found that I really enjoyed and I got a few parcels and I already have a few things that I have been sort of buying over the years that I wanted to share. So without further ado, let's go to brand number one that I bought quite a while back. So the first thing I got, but I can't quite remember actually whether it was YouTube I saw it on first, but I keep seeing it on Instagram, so I'm gonna say Instagram, is a brand called Regal Rose. Their stuff is stunning. They have multiple collections out now and there's a lot of sort of gold and silver. I prefer silver and I bought a few items, but predominantly what I wanted was this thing here. Isn't this adorable? It's a little velvet, coffin-shaped jewelry box. It is the cutest thing ever and it has a little button there, which is absolutely non-functional and I keep forgetting and try and press it, but actually all it does is it just opens like this and it has ring storage. So I have some of my rings, the bigger ones, sort of sitting in here. And it's really, really cute. And it's very velvet velvet and it looks beautiful, feels luxurious, absolutely beautiful. I really, really wanted it, but I also wanted this pair of earrings here, which is called the Ophelia Gothic Cross Hoop Earrings, and I got them in silver. And you see these a lot on Instagram. And these are what those are. They are absolutely massive, but they're statement earrings, so they're supposed to be. They're absolutely beautiful, like really, really beautiful. I love them. And everything comes in these sort of cute little regal rose pouches and in little bags as well. And it comes with like, polishing cloths, there's instructions, everything, so the service is really, really good, the packaging is very, very good. And since, you know, as usual, I think it ships from the UK, so shipping here, and I'll put all the details down below, shipping to New Zealand is pricey, so, you know, might as well A, wait for a sale, B, buy, you know, more than one pair of earrings. So the other pair I really, really liked is called the Drakkar Gargoyle Knocker earrings, also in silver. And they're super cute. I love gargoyles, so I really, really wanted these earrings. Ooh, had them the other way around. So this is what they look like. And they are super cute. Very, very cute. I really like them as well. And again, separate packaging, all that. So that's Regal Rose. So I completely forgot to mention this piece because it's sitting in my ear and I completely forgot about it because of that, but it's this beautiful piece called Narcissa, which I thought was earrings for some reason when I was looking at it on the website because I obviously can't read. And I ordered it and it turned out to be a piercing and I didn't have this piercing at all. So I actually did the piercing just to put it in because it was so gorgeous.
So the second brand that I wanted to show you today was a brand called Corvus Nest, which I think is based in Hungary, but I'll double check and put it down below along with all the socials and relevant links as well. So I saw it on Instagram and I instantly fell in love with firstly this stunning heart necklace. And this is actually an amethyst. So it's absolutely gorgeous and it comes in different crystals as well. And I just saw it and I fell in love with it. And also it has matching earrings, which are also absolutely gorgeous. Again, these, these are called shield maiden earrings and they come again with different crystals. So I got a matching amethyst with the necklace. And also you can choose your own runes and you can choose a rune pair earrings so they don't have to match. So I actually have two different ones. One is called Algis, which is protection and sort of round control of emotions. And the other is called Tear, which is warrior energy. So that's pretty cool and you can choose, you know, what you want to wear. So these are absolutely stunning. I can't remember about the packaging because it's been, I think, one or two years now that I've got them. But they're absolutely beautiful and these are quite light. The heart one isn't and I think I might have changed the chain. I think it came with a longer one, but I sort of alternate between them because you can wear it as a longer necklace or more like a choker kind of thing. So absolutely gorgeous, really, really beautiful. Love the quality. Corvus Nest, it used to be on Etsy, but I think now moved to just her own site and she is on Instagram so I'll link that down below but yeah check it out it's really really pretty Store number three, I got this direct off Instagram. It was actually an Instagram exclusive and they do have a Etsy shop and the shop is called Devi Teddy and it has a little logo that is like a devil sort of teddy bear and I'm wearing it. Can we see how amazingly stunning this is? We will do a close up. This is called the Lunar Bat Choker. This is handmade moons and everything and the bat charm. It is absolutely gorgeous. I saw it on Instagram, I instantly wanted it. I don't know if it's one of a kind, I think it is actually, because it said sold or maybe there was a few of them, but it's just, ah, and they made cosplay and various accessories and some of them are more colorful than others. But this one was just, it really stood out to me. So I really wanted to get it. I will again post all the socials down below, but it came in this absolutely adorable little box and it says thank you there. And I mean, just the packaging and everything, everything is very sort of recyclable because it's all paper. There's nothing, nothing plastic in it. And it had this absolutely adorable note as well. And here's the little logo. Yeah, so it's obviously a personalized message because it says I hope your choker has reached you safely all the way in New Zealand and that you love it as much as I enjoyed making it. I freaking adore it. It is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. And there's all the socials in the back, but I'll post them down below. So yeah, I absolutely love it. Thank you so much for sending it. And it, it was fairly quick actually getting here. I mean, comparatively to other things, I think it was two or three weeks or something like that, which is for the UK to New Zealand, it's not bad. These these days it's like four weeks or something, so on average. So, I mean, this is just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I'm absolutely in love with this as, as I was when I first saw it on Instagram. It's, it's completely unique. I've never seen anything quite like it. And the fun part is it comes like with a 
ribbon sort of part as well as a velvet part and you can sort of swap them around and it gives you extra length so you can actually adjust it. It's not quite, I guess, simple to just put on on your own but once you get the hang of it I think I'll be able to sort it out. It's beautiful, love it. Right, now we're done with jewelry. So shop number four also has some jewelry but I bought some clothes from there so I wanted to focus on the clothing next and these came fairly recently, haven't worn anything, haven't washed anything, no idea, just did almost, I think I haven't even tried everything on, but there will be a try on after this showing this stuff off. I don't know if you've heard, Manku Shop from Manku Gil, I'll put it down below. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correct, but there you go. One woman show from Missy Sahagun, I think the last name is. I'm probably butchering it, but to be fair, I doubt she could pronounce mine, so let's keep it at that. But uh, absolutely gorgeous. She is probably the hottest chick on Instagram, like seriously. I keep trying to rip off her fringe style, but I fail miserably because her hair is gorgeous, her eyes are gorgeous, her lips are gorgeous. I mean, here's a picture. <sighs> I mean, amazing. And I've been wanting to buy something from there for a while, and there was a few things that I wanted, but then I saw <laughs> this, and uh, I, uh, this is completely out of character, by the way, for those who actually know me, completely out of character because it's, well, it's pink. But, <laughs> I mean, I like pink in general, but I never really wear it. And I mean, look at this. How freaking cute is that? And it has ears, and it's just, cutesy, wootsy, cuddly wuddly is what this is. Not to mention, this whole thing is also done in conjunction with another, I think it's a one woman show as well, from Widow Witch Lashes. I did a video on one of the beautiful palettes that they've done, the Adams Family palette. I'll put the video up there. There, you can see Widow Witch Lashes. And on this one here, you can see Manku Gil. I have no idea what that means or where it comes from, but uh, that's what the Instagram is called as well. I'll put all the info down below and look at the super cute coffiny label. And also, it's, it's like a little cropped hoodie. I got this in an L, so I will be trying that on. It's adorable. I, I probably won't wear it outside the house. I mean, I'm not super comfortable wearing something that says sex kitten. Hence, it's even more confusing why the hell I would buy the next one, which is the matching tank top, which again s says sex kitten. I have no idea where I got this, but this is how hot this chick is. She can sell ice to Eskimos, seriously. And again, it has a little logo there. And again, the most adorable coffin logo there. So I got, all I got is tops, I got like three tops, and I got all of them in an L, and they're super cute, I'll probably just wear them at home, although this next one I can probably wear to the gym, and this is the one I've actually wanted for ages, because these, the Sex Kitten ones, they're limited edition, but they occasionally come back, but you know, so it came back, so I thought I'd get it. But this top is part of the usual collection, it says black number one is about me. And again, it has, you know, the cute coffin detail and it has the cute little logo there. And I mean, all I can say is if you don't know what this means, go look up a band, just stop the video, seriously, stop the video, go look up a band called Typo Negative, find the song called Black Number One. And if you've never heard it before and you hear it and you fall in love with it, like pretty much most people I know, do thank me down below. I'll be waiting for that because it's if you haven't heard this and I'm introducing you to this, I will be super freaking honored for the rest of my life because it's like such an amazing song. It's so much fun and that band is freaking awesome and I won't tell you anymore. Go look it up. But yeah, so every, every sort of gothy-ish identifying woman loves this song probably so yeah go look it up if you don't know uh, and so really cool this shipped from the US from LA and each garment came with this and this is the coolest washing instructions 
I have ever freaking seen in my entire life. I mean, they're little coffins and they were put on each garment telling you what to do with them. If that's not adorable, I don't know what is. Also came with a little thingy saying what to tag to get featured and a little handwritten note with a 10% discount off my next order. Thank you, Missy. You are absolutely gorgeous and your stuff is gorgeous and I can't wait to wear it. Probably not all of it outside the house, but I'm just really in love with the concept. So that is that shop there. Okay, and the last, but certainly not least, I got something that I've been waiting for. For It's actually shipped super quick. I was very surprised. It took like two weeks from the UK. I don't know how the hell they shipped it, but thanks very much. So unwanted apparel, 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 let's call it apparel, be more English about it. Uh, man, I wanted this for ages. It's been all over Instagram. Everyone's wearing it to the gym and I'm not wearing it to the gym and I wanted to. The designs are absolutely stunning. It is pricey because, well, unfortunately in New Zealand is not a British pound country and we're like, take the pound price and times two and our incomes are probably not way up there with the UK either and then they're shipping, but the stuff was gorgeous. So that's my excuse and I'm using it. And it came in this lovely box. So what I want to show you is this ribbon there. How freaking cute is that? And it says unwanted and it has little coffins and moons. Like absolutely adorable, adorable. Absolutely adorable. So what I got, again, this came really nicely wrapped and I already unwrapped some of it, but what I got was it came in this, how cool is this bag by the way as well? Like it has little vampire toothies there and I got an exercise set. Basically, I got a top, which is this top here. I just fell in love with the design and the colors of it. It is so gorgeous. They have the cutest little label. It says, it's time to kick ass and chew bubble gum. And I'm all out of gum. <laughs> this is really cute. And then it has that little picture there of sunglasses and stuff and it has the most adorable label again and this is actually made from recycled plastic and polyester fibers so it's really super green as it says welcome to the green side so it's really really cute i have sort of tried it on and it's really nice so i will do a try on as well after this but really cute i love it i absolutely love it and i got matching pants so I think the top I got, I can't remember what size, I'll need to look it up and put it in the description there. And then I got pants, same little label, same label about the green stuff. But yeah, so I got these in a small, really lovely pattern, like I'm absolutely loving it. And it has a zip in the back, so this is a little pocket for things like keys and things like that. So pretty good quality. And it's thick material, I hear it is, I think it was from the website, it says it's squat proof and everything. So those are the pants. And the other thing I wanted, because oh, I really wanted it, how adorable is this bag? It is just absolutely stunningly gorgeous. I mean, purple, shiny, with lime green, not to mention, it can be worn as both a backpack and a handbag in one. I mean, it doesn't get any better than this. Really, it doesn't. I mean, it, it has everything I wanted. And I, I've never had a jack-o'-lantern kind of bags. And I've seen quite a few on Instagram, uh, which I can't remember what company it was. I'll, I'll put it down below what it was, but they're like all sold out of everything. And then I saw this, and I could actually get it, so I did. I haven't actually opened it, let's see. Ah, it even has two zips, so that's real convenient. Uh, so you don't have to sort of open it and everything falls out kind of thing. And it has heaps of inside pockets. Ooh, and the pattern inside is super cute as well. Like, it looks like really good quality sort of stuff. I don't know if I'll actually wear it to the gym. I think it's a bit too much. Well, when I say too much, I think it's 
too good to wear to the gym is what I mean. I do have my little Killstar Skeletor backpack that I take. Because I don't really change at the gym, I just go, it's really close, I just go there and shower at home sort of thing. But, yeah, this is, this is adorable. I will definitely use the hell out of it. And it matches my nails, which is also very important. Love it. Oh, thanks so much for sending this so quick, guys, too. It, was, it shipped, like, super instantly. I'm in love with this. I will take lots of pictures, and I will take pictures in the gym as well, and post them on my Instagram, which will also be below. Yeah, and uh, that's just the receipt. And, uh, again, a little handwritten note. Thank you for your order. Enjoy. And it has a heart. Thank you very much. I will enjoy the hell out of this. I promise you. So, yeah. That is everything, and now we will go to the try-on of the things that need try-ons. So that was what I got off Instagram. So far I haven't actually got anything that I didn't like, but there will be another video coming of the same series, which is more makeup related, because I did find a few things around makeup tools and makeup itself that I got off Instagram. Look out for that one, that will be coming up soon. And thank you for joining me on my channel. If you are new here, you're very, very welcome. I hope you like it here and stick around. If you consider subscribing, you'll get notifications every time I upload a if you hit the uh, bell notification button thing, then you will get notified mostly on Sundays. Well, Sundays, New Zealand time, that is, is when I usually upload. Depending on where you are, that may vary. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you very much. It shows me that people are watching and are interested. Please comment down below, ask me any questions. Tell me about anything cool you've seen on Instagram that you like, bought and loved. I'd love to find out about more stuff. Link anything down below as well, would love to see more. And if you bought any of these things, I'd be very keen to know what you thought of them. A lot of these are small brands, which is very important to support as well. Because, I mean, we all love Killstar and stuff like that, but, you know, there's plenty of really cool other creators out there that are making super interesting things, so I'm really keen to find out more about them and support them as well. So thank you very much for watching, have a pleasant time of day wherever you are, and greetings and salutations to you.